die today or tomorrow that I have the best, God gave me the best group of friends. Even though we've never met, I feel like I can confide in you all anything. But I want to tell you about the makeup I'm wearing because that's what I was, everyone asked me to do blue. So I waited for this blue blouse to come in that my son ordered me. It's absolutely beautiful. It's got the big arms. It's that bracelet I showed you the other day. And I'm wearing the same half eyelashes. And I used all Man Eater products on my eyes and made them blue. And I used this taupe pencil. Right here, underneath my eyes, down here, because I didn't want to go too dark. But then I filled it in. I did it step by step, so perfectly, and I got right into the camera so that you all could see close-ups. But there's no sound. My luck, the piano sound on this one too. We used uh, this color as my liner, the dark one, and uh, we used. You always have to go in with the transition. So we went in with the transition with these two mixed together up all through here. And always keep light on your lid. So I took this one and this one and mixed. I put this one down, but it was way too dark. It made, made me look like somebody beat me up. Then I put this shiny white one over top of it. And it gave this effect. And that was all of them. And then I took this uh, one right here in the middle again. I think it's called, I can almost see it without my glasses. My new contacts are so good. Fabulous. And I took that and ran it underneath here. Oh, it's just from the pupil on. We made the eyeliner this time. We did not use a felt tip liner. We used this. And we started from the pupil of my eye and extended it way out and then blended toward the end. And then I used the... CoverGirl concealer, which I literally love, but it, the stick is just really nice. But you, it's so hard; you have to keep digging back in to get the product out. But the product itself is wonderful. But they put it on a stick. It's a little, a little hard to get a whole lot out on that stick. Stick, you have to keep sticking it back in. But the product that you get out is amazing. But you know, there's a lot of amazing concealers out there. I believe it was. Uh, one of my subscribers, LB, said that L'Oreal concealer is fantastic, too. And then I brought a little bit of that blue also right into here at the corner. I'm not sure I like that too much. This is the blue eye, and they asked for a dark lip. So I had the uh, ColourPop stain. No, it was the, uh, the flower. See, the flower or the ColourPop stain. If you always put a stain on and then blot it down, in five seconds it'll look like, you know, when we were young and our lips were pink, but now they're not anymore because they've lost all their color. Looks like that. And when you use a stain, just get it dry or blot it, wait for it to dry. And then all of a sudden you can run your finger across it all day long and nothing will come out. So then they asked for a red lipstick. Instead of using red, I went for CoverGirl again because this is new. I saw it on Amazon. I just had to have it because it says lip stain. Anything that's a lip stain is great for us when we're older because it doesn't run down into our little cracks running down our lip. So this was the uh, CoverGirl lip stain. And I believe it's um, lavender or orchid. It might be called orchid. I'll list it. And I used the brush. Again, my concealer brush. To put the concealer on. And for my eyebrows, you know, I made them thicker. I, I brought, I came in on everything so close. I, I'm i just so mad that that had, this light was off and there was literally no sound. Because I wanted to show you the beautiful necklace that I got from Amazon. It's supposed to be a choker. I couldn't find the hole to make it a choker. It's supposed to come up higher like that. I couldn't really find it. If my son was home, he'd probably find it for me. It was my. Last name there, yeah, always wear that. And I think that's everything. I just wanted to thank you all so much, uh, and thank Selvi Queen Cindy for. I must have got, after she was done with her live. I got like twenty two new subscribers again. Oh, Carol, she's always shouting me out. Little poet Susan, she's a kind heart. Everyone, everyone, 
I, like I said, I, I'd love to share it, my subscribers with you, the ones that, that I watch that are you, I, half, three-fourths of mine are YouTubers themselves. So if you touch their face, you'll come up with their channel. And you can decide whether you like them to watch or not, too. Because I don't, I don't even not, not telling anybody. I don't want you to subscribe to anybody that will help you. Anyway, I made my hair a little too dark, as you can tell. So to compensate for it, I found this silver spray. So I sprayed that through my hair, which ended up gray. So I was like, yeah, I might as well have left it alone. Because I left the dark hair color on a little bit too long. I've been having a lot of trouble with my hair. Moving toward arthritis, my back and my right leg have been going out. So I've been walking with a cane. At least it was my father's cane. So. But God bless you. God bless my new subscribers. God bless my old subscribers because they have, they have a heart string to my heart. Every one of you. Every one of you. Truly. On my, my last day of breath, I, I'll know I have friends. I've never felt so loved. God bless you. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. I'm so sorry that I'm didn't do this step by step. Well, I did do it step by step. I came so into the, I brought the camera closer. I was right in your face so you could see every little detail and not one bit of sound because that green light wasn't on. The red light was on. God bless you. Love you. If you want me to go through this again in more detail, next time I'll have blonde streaks in my hair. My son bought me a pale blonde hair color. I'm going to stick a few strips in from the, and just the front frame strips. God bless you. Love you. Thank you. At least this one was a lot shorter. The other one was 41 minutes. Terrible. Love you.